Hi there and welcome to the advanced PPC campaign generator training videos. In this video I'll talk about how to use the import campaign feature. So you can import using a file or text. If I wanted to import from a file I select import from file and then we'll just import something that I already had saved earlier. You'll see it in this format and um, it gives you an opportunity to preview what it would look like and then Although you can't see the columns, you can scroll over it and click them to see what is actually going to be imported. Anything that's purple will be imported. Anything that's gray is not imported. But if you did this from AdWords Editor, you can rest assured that everything will be imported correctly. Finish. And this tells you that the CSV has been imported here. Here's what the campaign looks like. And that's pretty much how you import a campaign from file. Let's go ahead and delete this campaign. To do that, have it selected, then hit Delete Campaign. Now let's import from text. For this example, I'm just going to copy one. So I'm going to copy a large campaign. I just copied that. And then we come here and we paste into the CSV text area here. then hit next here we can see the top headers the same situation as last time hit next and this will show you a preview when it's finished how many campaigns ad groups keywords and text ads were imported so that's done hit finish and we should see our campaign populate in the tree to the left. And here it is. So, we can expand it. And like I said, this one is a massive, massive campaign. So it has 25,000 keywords in it, 2,319 ads. So that's why it took a little time. But, yeah, you can import your campaigns just like that. And something you might see is that we have all match type broad. So if we wanted to actually change that to include phrase and exact, we could say phrase and exact, modified broad and broad, save changes. And when I hit yes, that's essentially going to create every single keyword with all of its different match types. So now when we go to the groups tab, we can see we have 101,000 keywords within this account now. All there is to do is to export it again and we've essentially quadrupled our account size. Like this. And there's also another benefit when you're importing your campaign you can update all your bids at once if you want. If you want to keep your bids the same right after you have imported them, then I would recommend if you change something like this and you hit save changes, make sure you hit no because that will override the bids if you go and hit yes. Another thing to keep in mind is when we have our campaigns in here, we can undo groups. So let's say we wanted to undo a, um, I don't know, lamp. I see a lamp in here. So we have different ad groups for lamps. We could undo these groups by clicking this arrow button here. Like so. I'm not going to do the whole thing, but what happens is those lamp keywords get put on this tab here, the grouper tab, and now we could reanalyze this group of keywords to regroup them essentially. So we see lampshade manufacturing insurance. These four groups appear, so we can create groups out of those. So I just click create groups. We'll analyze again, and if we want we could just have lamps insurance. Create groups, and we've essentially regrouped our keywords. 
But now we might have separate or multiple instances of ad groups. So to be sure, what we want to do is click this Clean Up Campaign. And just hit Yes. And this will essentially remove any, it'll basically merge any groups that are duplicate. And it'll merge the keywords into those correct groups. And so that's essentially how you use the Import Campaign feature and how you use the Cleanup Campaign feature. Like I said, you can just generate your campaign, export it, and that's it. You're done. Thanks for watching.